An American mother and daughter visiting Israel on vacation are free after two weeks in captivity. But 10 more Americans are thought to be among those still being held by the terrorist group Hamas. Fox's Caroline Shively reports from Washington. I spoke with my daughter earlier today. She sounds very good. She looks very good. She was very happy and she's waiting to come home. After 14 days in captivity, two Americans kidnapped by Hamas are now free. Judith Renan and her 17-year-old daughter Natalie were captured by the terrorist group in Israel, along with roughly 200 others who are still being held in Gaza. It's impossible to adequately put into words the agony they're feeling of not knowing the fate of their loved ones. The mother and daughter were visiting a kibbutz to celebrate the Jewish holidays when they were taken hostage. Word of their release spread quickly near their home in suburban Chicago. We've been inundated with messages from people around the world. Phone doesn't stop ringing and the texts are coming in. People are excited. People are, want to make sure that the news is true. We were thrilled. Thrilled is an understatement. Um, it's a miracle. As the war rages on, 10 more Americans are still unaccounted for. Thought to be among the hostages, Hamas has hidden in tunnels and underground bunkers throughout Gaza. It's important for people to remember what Hamas is. This is a terrorist organization. President Biden spoke to both of the released hostages and told them they will have the full support of the U.S. government as they recover. In Washington, Caroline Shively, Fox News.